Uh, Delray Beach today looking good. A lot of people enjoying the beach, but the sand is super hot. So be careful every head down to the beach today. Make sure you wear your Crocs, flip flops, or whatever you're doing down there. Water temperature is nice though, 78 degrees, low risk for rip currents today. Wave heights only one to two feet. A couple of storm systems rolling across the country are going to help us out a little bit. It's going to help to break down the heat. Not yet, not for the next few days, but Pretty soon, we're going to see temperatures that are a bit cooler. In the meantime, this is the water vapor imagery. Dry air over here to our east, dry air down to our southwest, and there's certainly some dry air behind these fronts that are moving along through the Gulf Coast states. We'll get back to that in a moment. A quick look at the live radar. Got showers and thunderstorms moving off the Space Coast here. Couple of showers just off the Treasure Coast, but we don't really have much rainfall around right now. We do have the slight chance for a few afternoon showers and thunderstorms. Today, that rain chance is only 20%, but it will start to go up as we move through the weekend. You see the 20% here today, but then 30% tomorrow as we get a little boost in moisture with the highest chances for rain on Sunday, courtesy of the first of two cold fronts that will be moving through the area. It's a warm front over top of us now. Here you see a couple of showers and thunderstorms in the afternoon and evening hours for tonight. Then tomorrow, a few showers and storms bubbling up by the time we get to the late afternoon and evening and being pushed over toward the east coast. As we get to Sunday, the first of two fronts starts to move in. That generates some instability in the atmosphere, gives us a chance for our scattered showers and thunderstorms, especially Sunday afternoon and evening. Second front moving through on Monday does kind of the same thing, but with a little less rainfall. Temperatures right now in the 80s and 90s, pretty close to the 90s in most spots. Indian River Shores, you're at 87. Vero Beach, 87 degrees right now. We've got 88 in Basswood Estates and in Eagle Island and Fort Drum, 87 in Okeechobee, 90s for Jupiter Farms, the Acreage, Loxahatchee, and Wellington right now. West Palm Beach now at 90 degrees. So here's the first front. Swings on through the Gulf Coast states over the next couple of days down through the panhandle of Florida and makes its way down toward us as we get into Sunday afternoon and evening. Secondary front swinging in on Monday helps to reinforce the rainfall, but also helps to break the heat and we'll start to see those temperatures go down a bit. So for today, near record highs, a few storms possible tomorrow, hot and humid. Probably some records tomorrow, isolated afternoon storms and then the chance for scattered showers and storms as we get into Sunday and Monday. Low risk for rip currents today. Hot and humid. Here's a quick look at the seven day forecast. Temperatures low to mid 90s today. Low to mid 90s on Sunday, but with those higher chances for rain. Then more low 90s than mid 90s on Monday. And look at this. Back into the 80s we go Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday with low chances for rain. That's a look at your forecast. We'll be right back.